On Thursday, we found out that the U.S. weekly jobless claims were at a better than expected 1.3 million as workers slowly returned to their jobs in the wake of rising coronavirus cases. Meanwhile, the European Union's chief Brexit negotiator said significant divergences persisted in, this, in its talks with the U.K. on their new relationship from 2021. Welcome to the Tikmil Update. I'm Kenna Daniel, the founder of the Investiva Movement. Make sure to subscribe to the Tikmil YouTube channel and support us by liking and sharing this video with your forex trading friends. On Friday, we'll be looking at Canada's jobs report and industrial production numbers from France and Italy. Today, I'm looking at the CAD yen pair, which once again wasn't able to break above the pivot level of 79.33 and is heading back down towards the lower band of its current range at 78. The pair is also testing the upper band of the daily Ichimoku cloud. If next week it's able to confirm a break below it, we'll have a brand new medium term bearish signal that could open doors for further drops towards 76. Which direction do you think the CAD yen pair is headed towards in the medium term? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading in the financial markets involves a risk of loss and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel. I'll get back to you with more updates next week.